Hey guys, Steve here again from RC Tanks and Trucks 24-7 and I just wanted to show you my recently pretty much 90% complete Ford uh, F350 High Lift Series by Tamiya. Now this obviously isn't a standard uh, stock High Lift that you get uh, ready to uh, run out of the uh, kit but I have made some uh, modifications. What you see here is how I pretty much purchased this uh, RC car. I was lucky enough to get it like in the other video I said and it was just a fluke that I saw it. So as you can see it's been raised quite substantially. I have jacked up the body with some mods. It's also got air filled uh, G made shocks, I'm sorry, G made tyres which are great because you can pump them up like a real car. Um, like that you can make them much stiffer, sorry much, uh, sorry what's the word, harder I guess and softer great uh, great set of tyres and their bead locks as well not aluminium but plastic G made uh, 100 and, I think 110 or, or 90 mil aluminium threaded body shocks and the G made or Junfac um, four link suspension setup now with the standard if you put this kit on with these wheels it will rub quite considerably up here so I've done some modifications with the body and I've actually raised it up about I would say, I don't know if you can see in there right in there roughly about probably 13 millimeter spaces, aluminium spaces on the stock uh, body mounting system there just so it raises it up so now under full load there's no actual rub rubbish on the, on the uh, panel anywhere which is which is good it's very annoying when it just starts scrubbing around everywhere as you can see here as well the front it's got the uh, G made high lift axle set up as well gets it off the uh, out of the original position up here in with a long servo linkage and it's very sloppy and not very responsive so up here is great just make sure your, your servo is waterproof or you keep it away from the water where possible now I'll probably add some more mods to this, uh, I'll put a speaker in there with the Benedetti TBS mini system just for a bit of laughs and I think it adds a bit more realism. The kit also came with these uh, exhausts here which look pretty cool. If you get the full uh, sound and um, control system from Tamiya, there's a rumble unit that makes it rumble like that uh, when stationary so these actually look like they're moving which is pretty cool and a nice touch um, I'll show you what's inside or under the under the hood and don't worry, about, don't worry guys I'll definitely get some more videos of the of uh, up and running so here's the uh, basic setup inside of Tamiya High Lift as you can see plenty of room here for a, a large uh, even a hard cased lipo battery which is no problem um, I have a Novak Ega 2S slash 3S rock crawling system um, paired up with a 55 turn Novak uh, expert motor which has a lot of uh, punch and it works quite well with this truck and uh, yeah I'm very happy with it. It's more than enough power or uh, this truck needs really. Like I said it's not an axle or axial or something like that. Or trail finder so it's not as suited to the trails but with these with this setup I think it is it's got here carbon steel another mod carbon steel drive shafts here very strong they'll take a bit of uh, punishment but uh, overall a very nice truck and uh, yeah I'm, I love it actually uh, it's one of my faves so far I've got a few other projects on at the moment, including the uh, build series for the uh, G-Made Sawback. So that's another one of mine on the, on the horizon. But there, yeah, look at that, beautiful. I definitely had a light kit, so that's that's one of the uh, things I do moving forward. Get this all lit up, uh, looking all nice and stuff, like the uh, Tamiya Mountain Rider that I have. What else? That's pretty much it. Oh, one more mod here. Obviously, with lifting up the body nearly 15 millimeters, I've had to lift this. So, I've redone some mounting holes, lift it up. 
the front bull bar so obviously it looks like it should so uh, there we go guys ready to hit some trails happy days once again appreciate all your support and thanks for watching the video if you liked it give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more guys any questions please uh, please ask don't uh, hesitate and any ideas or things you want to see on the channel just let me know thanks guys see you later